In this lesson, I'll show you several examples on how to multiply a monomial by a monomial. Question 1 reads, simplify each expression. In question A, we have x to the power of 2 times x to the power of 3. We'll need to use the exponent laws here. And the exponent laws tell us that if we have two factors of the same base, then we can add the exponents. So we have x to the power of 5. 2 plus 3 is 5. In question B, we're multiplying the monomial 3y by 2y to the power of 3. Here we have numbers, so we can multiply 2 and 3 together, that's 6. And then the base is y. This has a power of 1, but it's not written. We add the exponents for the same reason we added the exponents here. We have y to the power of 4. In question C, we have negative 5xy to the power of 2. That's our first monomial, and our second monomial is right here. We'll start with the numbers, negative 5 times 2 is equal to negative 10. x times x to the power of 3 is x to the power of 4. And y to the power of 2 times y to the power of 2 is y to the power of 4 as well. That's the answer to question number 1. And in question number 2, we have more of the same except these are a little more difficult. In part A, we have x to the power of n times x to the power of 2. The bases are the same, so we add the exponents. But because 2 and n are not like terms, we write it out as x to the power of 2 plus n. In question B, we have 3y to the power of k times the monomial 2y to the power of k plus 1. I'm going to multiply 3 and 2 together. That part's easy. It's 6. And then I have y to the power of k times y to the power of k plus 1. I'll expand this for you. You have y to the power of k, this, plus k plus 1. k plus k is 2k. They're like terms. 2k plus 1 is the exponent, so we have 6y, 2k plus 1. And in our final example, we have 5a to the power of 3, x to the power of 2. Technically, we have three monomials. Let's go ahead and multiply the numbers out. 5 times negative 3 times negative 2. These two negatives make a positive. It makes 6. 6 times 5 is 30. And then I'll move on to the a's. We have a to the power of n times a to the power of 3 times a. n plus 3 plus 1 is a to the power of n plus 4. 3 and 1 are like terms. And finally, we only have one x factor in all of this expression, so we'll write down x to the power of 2. And there you have it. That is how to multiply a monomial by a monomial.